Welcome back everybody, some everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. I thought I'd do something a little bit different today. I'm going to walk you through my course records and my stats and then we'll play a bit of gameplay. So, where am I? I've played 4,256 holes. Uh, my um, club skill, 21 power, 12 control, 11 backspin, 7 backdoor, but that's overall. Um, if you have a look at my clubs, I've powered up everything bar the 5 wood, the 4 iron, the 9 iron. And the um, the wedges, control wise, I've got pretty much everything. Again, the five wood and the four iron I just don't use because my three iron is so overpowered. Why would you use the four? Um, and the five is pretty overpowered, so it kind of just lives in that gap, doesn't it? Um, and the same with the five wood. Why wouldn't you play the three or the five iron over the five wood? So I never really use it. I suppose I should try and level it up a bit. Um, obviously the backdoor scores are on the clubs you, you get more chip-ins on down the bottom. Um, and the sandwich I don't really use that much, so it's pretty low power because I generally just don't use it. So that's that. My longest official drive is 442. I got a 180 yard chip-in, hole in one, which we're still pretty proud of. And I got a 65 foot putt. Uh, course record wise, so Eagle City, I've pretty much done all the nine holes and I've got red scores for everything. Um, 18 holes I'm still lacking, so obviously regular teeny, I've only got 15 under. So it looks like 16 I suspect is what you need to get reds. And then I've got a couple of longs and championships to do. Alpina, 9 hole out I've pretty much done, but again I've got to get some better scores on some of the, certainly teeny cups I've struggled a little bit. Uh, 9 hole in, I've still got a couple of rounds to play, in fact we may play long teeny today. And then the 18s I haven't done much on. Canaloa. Again, out with nine, done everything bar a couple of the championships. But as you can see, got some yellows, got some greens. Regular mega, zero, it must have rained. Um, nine hole in, I've done much better on. I've got loads of red scores on there. But again, championship, I need to finish off. And obviously the 18s. Vortex is pretty sparse because I just don't like Vortex. But I suppose I should play it. Um, and I've got some not bad scores on there, to be fair. Look at splattering of reds. Um, but I've even got a light blue for being over par. Is that the first light blue? Oh, and I've got a light blue one, kind of lower, haven't I? Yeah, that's not good. Uh, Imperial, I've played a bit more of, so regular and long are pretty much done. I've still got the championship lengths to do and the 18s. But again, lots of scores to pick up there. Looks like 8 under is what you need. Mm -hmm. uh, green, I've made a bit of progress on, so I've done a fair bit of the 9 hole out, a little bit of the in, but I haven't played any of the 18s. Balata. I've actually played more on Balata than I have on Green. That's interesting. Uh, got loads of red schools as well. Yeah, I'm, but not playing the 18s. Namrong Bay. A few scores in there, but again, pretty sparse. And Pine Hills, obviously, only just got it. A lot of work to do on Pine Hills. Um, yeah, so what I'm going to do today is probably play Alpina in Longtini, I think is what we'll play. It's Alpina in Montini. Yeah, so I'd be interested to know where you guys are at, sort of course-wise and score-wise. I do think I am going to try and finish off and see if I can get a red score for every every setup. It's a fair bit of work in there, but you know you need some goals, and obviously you've got the tournaments as well in between to kind of break it up. But yeah, that's probably what we're going to go for. The online stuff, Turf Wars, just dead as a format. Every time I try and play it, the lobby waits are so long. The only way they're going to make that more attractive is to chuck out gems or um, or XP or something. Still haven't worked out how you get level 16 and 17. I figure it's something to do with, um, with the scorecard, which is why I think if I finish off some of the scores, maybe I'll get 16 and 17. Um... Because I haven't even had the whole thing where you kind of drop off. So it used to be if you had a couple of bad rounds, um, you'd lose a bunch of score. Sorry, you'd lose a bunch of levels. But that hasn't really happened. So I don't know what they've done with 16 and 17. So okay. it's a far four. Let's play Alpina. Obviously, we had the um, we had the tournament on this the other day, so I should be familiar with it. <laughs> he laughs. Um, I think my problem last time was I couldn't I couldn't get it up, Your Honour. Um, see, look at the difference there between my five wood and my three wood, and then my three iron's actually better than my five wood. So why would I ever hit the five wood? It's flattened dull. Anyway, sorry, enough of that. So 
let's try the driver. See if we can get it, get it somewhere up there. The problem really is getting enough altitude Master to get it up that hill because it drops. It's quite a flat shot. Oh, go on. Yeah, it just hits that front edge there. However, it's not too bad. It's pretty close. So we've got a chip in it. Again, our favourite nine iron. It just seems to be a better chipping club. Ooh. If you look, it just sits better. Yeah. Yeah, that was the slope, I think. We've got a putt, though. We've got a putt. There we go. Start with a birdie. Yes. Got it. Nice birdie. You're incredible. Yeah, now I've played an 18 obviously on this setup, but not a nine. So we've got some we've got some scores to aim at. It's a par three. So eleven's the par three. Again, can't really top spin it, so we're gonna have to come into the wind and try and get it a little bit past and back spin it. Nice shot. All the left hand sway in the world there. Will it even make it on? Oh, it's on the fringe. I love the RNG. If it had hit the impact there, I wouldn't have had any problems. So, again, let's try a little cheeky chip. Oh, I've probably got far too much power on that. That's going to need to hit. <laughs> you always want a bit more than you think, but maybe that was um, about as much as you should give it. It's a birdie birdie start. 12. Oh, 12. It's a path. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're into the wind. Oh, I we'll have a look. We'll have a look. We'll have a look. Oh, I don't even think I can even play that today. I haven't got a shot either from there. So what can we play? We probably play up here. Where's the wind going? Oh, go on, we'll have a go at this one. Yeah. The question is whether the wind gets it. Yeah, we should be somewhere reasonably safe. Yeah, we've got enough length. So 130 to go. Let's have a look down look at the green. So it will go left to right a little bit. Okay. So 9 iron in there. Again, not really enough room to do the top spin shot. So we'll go back to him. Just accept this way. That's Ooh. all right. It's up there. Oh, well, well. Up for an eagle. Don't let the eagle slip. Whoa, that's right. an interesting part. Looks like it slopes up. Is this it then? Breaking to the left. So the issue here is you're almost going to read it flat and then add on. So if that was a flat part, that's about the right break. But because it's uphill, I've got it a little bit harder, which has a tendency to straighten the shot out. <sighs> Hard to read. Maybe there. Go on. Yeah, not enough power. Lime was good. Lime was good. Just didn't get the power right. It's hard on those short ones. So three under. It's three birdies to start. More there, though, to be sure. More there. So oh, it's tucked in on the right. Yeah, and those trees are just sort of in the way. So again, we might go side spin here. Yeah. And again, side spin Master in theory that. keeps the sway down. I think the rough rule of thumb is there's twice as much opportunity for sway and back spin as there is with uh, top spin. And then side spin somewhere in between the two, or sort of like the top spin. So all things being equal, side and top spin is going to be more accurate than a backspin shot. But of course, backspin is massively useful in stopping stuff on greens. Oh, 14. So 14. Now, how long? Yeah, we should be able to chase up to it. In fact, we can play a three wood to it. Again, we don't want to bounce on the left. Bouncing on the left is bad. So again, we'll just hit it short and just try and run it up there. So we've got a top spin. Super top spin in this case. It's down the right hand side, so it should get a decent bounce. It's all about where it comes onto the green. 
Oh, it's not bad. 15 foot. Don't let the eagle slip. So we get an eagle pup. Okay. Sloping down, I think. Actually, not much break. Wait right to the left. There's more break earlier. But it's a 15 footer, so it will move. Okay, yes. But we got it. There you go. Yes. There it is. Always good to get an eagle. All 15. So 15. It's a four. Okay. Now again, we should be able to take those big, uh, big buckets are well out of play. The real question is, can you drive the green? Let's have a stab at it. Keep going. A little bit of right hand sway, so it should be in the right sort of spot. Going to bounce on the fairway. Is it going to chase her? Go on, go on, get up there, get up there, boy. So we'll get a putt at it. Thirty footer, mind you. Reasonably even break, but it does break more at the end. Breaking to the left. Oh. So it's probably about there, but it's going to need a bit of a hit. So it's going to play about 35, 36. So let's try about there. That's it. Go on. Oh, oh, just borrowed a bit much. Go for the However, birdie. we'll take that birdie cut all day. It's a seven under. Nice birdie. <laughs> yes. Got it. Excellent. Three holes to go. Don't make any oh, stupid errors. It's a par four. Again, water skip. No, we actually got the length to get past the water. Now, well, where's the pin? Again, this feels like a side spin shot. We don't need ultra. Super will do. Just to give us a bit of shape. So we're coming over that fairway. Just pitch there. There you go. Oh, it's going to be a little bit fast. Oh, that's enough. Bunker. Ugh. Yeah. Went miles. However, we're going to chip back. Actually, sandwich again. Oh, tricky to control the power out of the bunkers as well. Just get it close. Just get it close. That'll do. I'll take that. Go for the birdie. We've still got the birdie part. So even though we ended up in the sand, we get the birdie. Cool, nice birdie. Yes. So eight under. Two to go. Hole oh, seventeen. It's a par four. So seventeen's into the wind, but that shouldn't bother us. Our real issue is um, keeping it on the green stuff, if we're honest. So we'll go super spin. Which should. Great. Should all oh, caught a bit of the tree, but we should be okay. Just gonna end up on the rough. Yeah, took a bit of power off it. Never mind. Look at the gauge closely. Need a bit of challenge, don't we? Okay. So we're gonna lose a little bit from the impact. Get it up there and close, and I'll be happy. And oh, that's a bit further than I would have liked. But again, so hard to read them. So we've got a birdie pup. Sloping uphill. It's going to break a bit, but not miles. Oh, it's just broke more than I thought. So we're going to have to take a par. First par of the round. And that's a mistake. That's a straight mistake, isn't it? I'll take it. There it is. It's eight under. Last one. Four. Eighteen. It's a par. No need to worry about the water today. So we're going to spin if we can get it. We've got a little bit on it. Just to click those trees a little bit out of play and tuck us in a little bit. That should be all right. Are you just going to get up to the crest? Yeah. So 196 to go. We can attack the pin. And it'll have to be a backspin shot. Got the ultra backspin. So if we're in the region, it'll, it'll stop and grip. Oh, come back, come back, boy. So we're going to end up just a bit long. That's okay. We've got to chip back. Get our 9-9 out. That's going to be a touch too short, I fear. Where did it catch? Oh, just got it. 
I can't believe it. I didn't see that. I might want to see that again. Did it just catch the fringe? Yeah. Oh. I can't believe it. I'm a bit worried it was going to die on me there. So you finish with the eagle. We get 10 under. Not a bad round, other than that shot on 17. I'll take it. Stat should be pretty pretty good on this as well. Annual record. Yeah, we got a lot of greens. Missed a couple of fairways, which is interesting. I suppose we got, yeah, so I suppose we got the bunker, didn't we, a few times. So yeah, not a bad round. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, if you did, please like, share, and subscribe. Please leave a comment. Let me know what your scores are, and I'll see you next time for some more everybody's golf.